What is up everybody and welcome back to Last Day on Earth Survival. Hang on, let me just wave quickly. There we are. Right, so I've been doing the Raiders quest and it won't let me complete the second floor of the bunker even though I've done it multiple times. So I'm going to end up having to skip that. But I've been doing the hard mode. I've got myself a floppy disk and I've still got the big one to go and kill so I've got a few shotguns with me. Alright, let's head over there. Soldiers were leaving bunkers in a hurry. There's still lots of parts, gasoline and other useful stuff there. Go away, crash plane. You give me useless stuff. I'm never visiting you again. Alright, so I've got one day, 20 hours. Yeah, I've cleared out the entire bunker, all four floors, both normal and hard mode, apart from the big one, in under four hours. Actually, I think it took me in total about two hours, but the update has come and they've fixed the items getting deleted from the chopper, finally! Right, come on, can we load in? I want to go and safely loot bases and keep all of my loot. Right, come on. And here we go, let me just grab the stuff out. Uh, no, I want to get my shotguns actually. Um, game? Are you fucking kidding me? I thought they fixed this. For fuck's sake, the floppy disk as well, really? <sighs> Right, I'm going to go and find something else to do for this video, because there's that idea gone. Alright, what is up everybody? Welcome back. After that horrible, bloody, floppy disk getting deleted, I decided I would go home and go on a raid. I recorded the raid, I got 80 steel on the raid, the steel got deleted, and I rage quit. Um, literally just turned my computer off at the plug, I was so annoyed. Which deleted all of the footage because I hadn't cancelled the recording. But, I'm fine. I can breathe. And I, yeah, I stopped playing for like a good three or four hours. Logged back in and I've gotten a revenge raid. Oh yeah, I moved my turret inside. If you're raiding my base, this is the only section of stone that you can see. And this is the only door you see. So you break the door and you get shot by a turret. Ha. Right, new raiders quests, they want me to find a C4, kill 15 abominations, make some chests, clear the third floor of the bunker, and open five aid boxes. Keeping them, for now, right, actually let's take that out. If any of you didn't know, your truck can now be looted, unfortunately, which really sucks. I'll chuck a, if I can find it, I'll chuck a quick screenshot up on my map now of what I lost. It was basically shot a almost broken shotgun, a bit of gun parts, an aerial, and a few other bits. Right, I'm going to drive over there to use up some fuel in case I find a stack. Right. I recognise the name of this base. I have I've either raided it myself before, or I've seen a Star Snipe video of him raiding it. It's one of the two. I recognise it when we get in here, hopefully. Can I walk? Thank you. Okay, that is a trunk right there behind that door. Right, first things first, chest is empty, and we'll check, ooh, that is a nice skin on the chopper. Empty, didn't raise the noise fortunately. Right, carry on going around the outside. Hmm. Yeah, I've definitely raided this base before. Hmm. I think... It's strange. It's definitely strange. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I should not have done that. Damn. What I should have done is place the C4 on this wall behind there, and that would have opened the chest. And there we go. Ton of brick in there. Hopefully, ah, uh, yeah, we got the horde coming in. Right, I'm just opening everything around this furnace because I need some more steel after losing all of that. That would have been enough to fit completely finish off my two by two. I'm so, oh, so pissed off about that. Why are you trying to shoot the one that's furthest away? Right, come on, let's. Thank you. Two, three, four, and three flare guns. I'll take it. <laughs> and four of that pattern. Right. I'm probably just going to break everything here. I don't want to have to use more C4. I'm trying to be a bit conservative with it. OK. 
Okay. Is this where your steel is? That's where your wood is. And two, three. Okay, and there was some... Didn't get a good look, but it looked like there was some half-decent stuff in there. Okay, I did remember to bring medkits with me. That is always a bonus. Hate it when I forget to bring them. Uh, weapon broke. There we go. Alright, so I've, I think it was this one. Two side scocks. And I'll take that, take that, take that, take that. And I'll leave the rest of the stuff there as a maybe. Let's break this one. Two, three. It's all right. Hmm. Looking like those are all going to be food. Can't. They've got to have. Ah, there's a. Uh, there's a chest down here. Didn't see that. What are we get? There's the engine parts, and there's that. Right. Luckily, we got a um couple of science guns because I'm going to need to change out my M16 here because I think I'm going to take, it's going to break here, there we go, and boom, 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 dead. Right, whereabouts is my chopper over here, need to be remembering to store stuff in the chopper so in goes three full health flare guns, let's pour that on and stash that away and look we're back up to a lot of space for looting. Right, what was... No, 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 stop it. Didn't I just open a chest down here? There we go. Right, let's do that. See, now that you need the petrol to run the... I've done it again. Oh. I haven't got any sound anyway. Well, that's fantastic. Now that you need petrol to run the gen... The, um... Not the generator, what am I on about? What am I trying to say here? You need petrol to run your turret. I do like stone. Stone is very nice. Especially since I have pretty much none of it. You could drop a hatchet for it. Alright, I think I could open maybe one or two more. No idea why I haven't gotten any sound. I'm really tempted to blow into this big, big room here. You know, I think I've got the noise for it. Let me just quickly... Should I do it? Uh, you know what, I'm going to do it. Have I got the... No. Oh yeah, of course, i got the C4 in my inbox from when I lost some stuff. So I'll find it and be back in a sec. Okay, back with my 1C4, and I'm going to break into this wall here, and hope there's a chest behind it. No, that's some of the big one. Uh, they had a, ooh, they had a uh, completed acid bath there. No, stop it. Oh, I really should have checked what the noise level was at. Now I've got an empty slot, damn. I wonder why I've got no game sound. That is strange. Well, I hope you're enjoying the another video with music over the background. <sighs> I really should have checked the noise level. But they had a completed acid bath in there. <sighs> so they probably had spare circuits or something lying around. Damn. We got some engine parts. Cannot complain about that. And it was a revenge raid, so we don't need to give anything at all to the raiders. Let's go see what let's go see what gets deleted being removed from my chopper, hey? Right. Let's add the petrol to our stash. Uh, no room there. You know what? I'll just chuck it in the back of the generator. Why do I keep calling that thing a generator? It's not a generator. Where was I going? Hello, chopper. Right, let's take the engine parts. Hey, you didn't get deleted. And let's just stash these away for now. Holy shit! Didn't actually get bloody deleted for once! That's... perfect. I like that. 
Right. Yep, of course you still want me to go and do some quests for you. There's actually nothing really I can do in game at the moment apart from farm, because the bunker is currently closed for me. That's got a full stack of engine parts. Have you got more steel for me yet? Nah, yeah, that's all smelting down. I've done a bit of redesigning my base because the ATV no longer works as an impenetrable wall. So I've in the process of turning this into honeycomb as well. There we go. Up to 17 engine parts. Well, technically 37 engine parts. And five flare guns. Right. These combat ticket crates they can go in there and I'm gonna be able to open the red ticket crate on the next bunker opening the see now I've completely I've spread out my loot a bit because of the change with the ATV I didn't want anyone to be able to get straight to this chest and have all of my metal and everything there so I've kind of spread stuff out of it I moved the metal and um, yeah oak and stuff further in a bit to make it slightly safer but I am so close to finishing this room I've got the steel for this wall smelting at the moment I've already got 15 steel turned into plates I've got one there I haven't got one there but I've got five copper inside here so that is going to be enough to upgrade that and then I'll just have Three, well, two walls, a doorway, and a floor to go, and I can demolish these internal walls. And, oh, oh dear, dying of thirst, that's never good. Um, and I have to go a really long way to get to my um, food stash now. Around like this, there, and I didn't actually have any water in there. Oh well. And of course, I got some guns back here. Got my lovely scar there. I used up a lot of guns. I got bored, so I just blazed through the entire bunker on the um, on both modes, easy and hard. Right, how many gun parts have I got? Like, is it enough to upgrade my turret? Because I've got this feeling that there's five already in the turret. Four in there. That brings me up to 22. Ah, oh, and it takes 40 to upgrade, okay. Alright, so I'm going to need to wait and do one more bunker run to upgrade that to level 2. That's going to take five of my precious steel and one of my spare circuit boards. But that will add 300 health to it. That's ridiculous. Right, I get it. You're a thirsty guy. He's so impatient. There you go. No, don't drink that water. That's the wrong water. That's the water from your shower. There you go. Do you need to pee now? Nope, you're alright. So yeah, I've been grinding out walls, upgrading the external ring around my base. Most of this is at the moment still twig. It's going to take me about 3,000 pine planks to finish. But we get to hit that one there got broken by the horde earlier. But it's coming along well. Got this ring already completed. That blank foundation as you remember was where my chopper, not my chopper, where my turret was. So that base I just had 200 parts in the engine. I wish I had broken into somewhere else because I feel like there would have been better loot. But I did get three flare guns, which are not even in the game anymore. So I'd say it's worth it. Acid bath, ready to go almost. Just got to chuck the steel in. I'm going to be getting, when the bunker resets, I will definitely be getting another floppy disk. And I'm hoping that the next one is going to actually finally give me an infected box. Not sure why I want an infected box, but that's a lie. I do know why. I want an infected box so that I can have increased storage because it has so many item slots in it. There you go, and you can take that, those two as well. And I would like those. Uh, there's two left in there. Have I got any stone lying around? Not enough to upgrade. Oh, I should have taken raw stone, although I don't think he had any raw stone. Because I've got a lot of, I've got a lot of bricks now. I just don't have raw stone, so I've got so much of this stuck as the um, level one twig stuff. Can I access that from here? No. Okay, so I can access a chest through a wall, like this. I'm, I'm actually looking in that yellow chest right now. But I cannot open a generator through a wall, which is a little bit weird if you ask me. Right, how is my steel coming along? Do you need topping up with gunpowder, uh, charcoal? You do. And take it. Right. I'm going to need somewhere to just stash all of this stuff away. And then I'll... Hmm. 
you know what? I'm gonna call this episode here. It's been pretty stressful. I lost a floppy disk and 80 steel plates. 80, that is ridiculous. <sighs> Thanks for watching everybody, and goodbye.